Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to cancel your Jasper account and why I'm doing it. I'm Vince from Digital Nomad Institute, and let's get started. So the very first thing and the reason why I'm canceling my Jasper account slash Jarvis account slash Conversion AI account is because of the name change. Uh, it used to be known as Conversion AI, right? So if you type in Conversion AI, Conversion AI, you're going to see Jarvis, right? Let's see Jarvis slash Conversion AI, Conversion AI slash Jarvis, right? So it used to be called Conversion AI, then they changed it to Jarvis. And then when you type in Jarvis, they guess what? They changed it to Jasper. I don't make this up. Look. All right. So from Jarvis, they rebrand to Jasper. All right. Now, the question I have, and you know, you might you should ask yourself as well, is if a company can't even get their name right and they they keep changing it from conversion AI to Jarvis, then to Jasper, then you know, is that a good sign of the company's health? You know, or if they're running things smoothly, I, I don't think so. That's not a sign of confidence to me if they can't even get something simple like their branding. When it first came out, it was pretty decent, but as more and more AI writers came out, it's either they got better and Jasper slash Jarvis stayed the same or Jarvis just got worse. I don't know which one it is, but I'm about to show you uh, through this quick test. I'm going to use the past framework for Jasper, right? And this is everything in here. It's the same for all three AIs uh, that I'm about to show you. It's just you, know, you can go ahead and do a quick read just to show you that there's no funny business. And I'm going to go generate generate AI content. This one, I'm going to go ahead and I put the same thing in here, right? No funny business. I'm going to click on write for me. And the same thing with Rider AI, I'm going to go ahead and I put the same exact thing and it's for the past framework. Okay. Click on right for me. Okay. So right off the bat, I'm going to take, I'm going to copy their past framework from Jasper slash Jarvis, put it into here and get a score overall score of 78. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and now go into co uh, close this copy. I'm going to copy this one right here and I'm going to do the same thing. Okay, and it got an 82 score, right? Same, same past framework. Now I'm gonna duplicate this and do the same thing for Writer. I'm gonna go to Writer. I'm gonna copy their pass sample. I'm gonna paste it in here, right? 85. So if you if you wanna do, you know, apples, the all all three AI writers have the same input criteria, right? We go up here, same input criteria, all same, and they're all doing the pass system, right? They're all doing pass, right? This is pass here, this is pass framework here, and this is pass framework here. You know, as you can see, you know, by going through and inputting the sample, conversion AI uh, is fall behind. Is falling behind. <laughs> is it? Sorry, sorry, conversion AI slash Jasper slash Jarvis, whatever you want to call it. Um, I think it's called Jasper now. It's it's not really not really worth it. It's falling behind the output. You know, if it's you know the output or the quality of the writing, if it was the best, then okay, maybe it could it could charge a slightly higher price. Even even the price right now, it's not justifiable. Uh, they're charging, I believe, uh, sixty dollars, fifty nine dollars for using Jasper, and and the quality is subpar. So th those are the reasons why I am, you know, ultimately canceling my account. And let me show you how to, to go ahead and do that. I go into the dashboard and go down to the settings. And then from there, I go all the way down. Oops, sorry. Usage. I click on usage and billing. All right. And then it's kind of grayed out, so it's a bit hard to see. All right. But everything's white except for this area right here. You have to really look carefully. It says cancel account. Please be aware that canceling your account will cause you to lose all your saved content and earn credits on your account. Right? Don't, don't worry about it because uh, I'm going to show you probably two better alternatives to Jasper at this point. All right? So then, then you go ahead and uh, click on cancel your account. 
All right, then you're going to go ahead and get a survey. Okay, so then you can you can go ahead and type the reason why you're canceling. For me, I just said uh, other AI writers have better output at a lower price point. Plus, the fact that you change your name three times does not instill confidence. And I go ahead and click on next. Okay, then they offer you a 30% off for three months, and uh, you know it doesn't really matter if the output is not really there, then it's not really worth it. Decline offer. All right, then they have a, you know, how can you improve? Like, a, you know, you can feedback more. I put it in there already, just to be honest. And then, of course, they try to scare you. I mean, this is this is kind of annoying because if they they want to, if a customer wants to cancel, you know, you should really make it easy for them to cancel. You shouldn't make it this difficult, and they have to click five hundred times, you know, just to just to get out. Right? They already did you a favor by answering the survey for you. Uh, this is this is kind of not a very good user experience. Okay, and at the end you'll get subscription cancel, and it says you won't be billed again. So a lot of people are wondering, like, because I, I I knew I was about how to cancel my account, and why I you know probably asking me why I canceled my Jasper account. So I, those are the reasons, and you're wondering if there's any better alternatives, and I say yes, there are two. All right, uh, one would be Closest Copy, which I have a video about that, and it it's a, a lifetime. The, the benefit of this is a lifetime, you know, buy once, and you get it for life with all the upgrades type of content writer, and it, it's always improving. Like they always have, um, they always have upgrades to this, and it, it's just adding more and more long form content they're adding uh, this compete thing which is like an x-ray uh, for other articles so you can you can see how it's broken down it, this is the amazing I really like this this feature and other features as well I have a review video about this you can go ahead and check out later the other one I would recommend is Ryder um, it, it's a lot better price point <laughs> than uh, Jasper Jasper is just they just they think people are made of money you know and sixty dollars a month might not sound a lot for someone who um, you know, I guess someone who has a high six-figure income, but $60 is, is, is quite a bit, and it's not justified by the output, as I just proved, right, through through a third-party AI software. All right, so th this this doesn't justify the price. Now, before, when it first came out, it was new, it was the top dog, but as other AIs came out and they, they kept on improving, 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 I think Jasper stayed the same, and uh, I guess they were too busy changing their name. So... I, I I prefer I would recommend those two. I will show, uh, leave a link in the description below so you can go ahead and check that out. Uh, let's see for writer and for closer copy. Those are the two I would I would recommend over Jasper at this time. Uh, I can no longer recommend Jasper. It's it's just not not worth it. All right. So I hope this video was helpful. And if it was, could you please hit that like button? I am Vince from Digital Man Institute, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.